You know, it is crazy to think that a Fortnite player can pursue a professional career alongside being a sick content creator. I mean, like, that's like almost unheard of in the gaming world. Well, Mr. Fresh Asian holds both of these titles. You, you guys gotta check this out. Bunch of crunch, Charmy. What do you guys think is harder to do, all right? Consistently create Fortnite content for millions of viewers on a regular basis or go pro on Fortnite? Well, what about doing both? Today we're talking about the one and only Mr. Fresh Asian and how he's doing both of these things, going pro, while at the same time being one of the world's biggest content creators. You guys ready for this? Let's get this going. All right, guys, so the first reason that Mr. Fresh Asian is such a fantastic, like incredible competitive player in his region is this, like Mr. Fresh Asian is from Australia and he competes in the OCE region. As many of us already know, the competitive scene in the OCE region is not that talented, obviously compared to others like the North American East and European regions. So when we begin to consider the OCE region, there are only a handful of super talented competitive players that really come to mind, which generally include X2 Twins, Volks, and Mr. Fresh Asian. This isn't even like remotely proportional to the high level talent in other regions. The overall size of the region is relatively small and the prize pools aren't really that great. This honestly makes it kind of difficult to really gauge how good of a professional player Mr. Fresh Asian is, but man, let's, let's just dig a little deeper. Here we go. Although the competition isn't as challenging, Mr. Fresh Asian still has managed to earn almost 36,000 from Fortnite. This comes from 88 top 10 placements alongside 161 top 100 placements. What's interesting is that this amount of earnings would be respectable for any tier one player in any region. So despite him playing in an easier region, so to speak, he's still managing to place consistently high when the prize money is only given out to a lower percent of players. Many people will try and argue that, you know, due to his region, he's less of a pro player. But in reality, my friends, okay, when we look at this data proportionally, his placements and earnings will be incredibly respectable in any region. Due to the OCE region offering, you know, less prize pool money, they generally pay less players. This in turn makes it harder to make money in the region despite it being considered the easiest region. This is just one reason why Mr. Fresh Asian is such a renowned professional player. I'm curious to see like what you guys think of the regional advantages and disadvantages. So do you guys think that players have a certain advantage playing in one region, you know, based off the prize pool offered and the percent of players that make money each tournament? Let me know. I'm really curious to hear what you guys think. All right, guys, so before we hop into this next topic, I got to ask you guys this question. Do you want to exponentially grow your Fortnite skills? I hope that answer is yes, because that's why you're here, right? If so, which should definitely be yes, you need to check out ProGuys.com. We have the best coaches, man, that can take you to the next level. Okay, so now that we have discussed one of the reasons that makes Mr. Fresh Asian such an incredibly talented professional player, all right, we gotta explore why he's such a successful content creator as well. Here we go. When we look at Mr. Fresh Asian's content, I mean, it's drastically different from what you would expect from a professional player. When we look at, you know, other professional players across the world, a trend content type almost immediately emerges. Many times, professional players will post montages of high-level Fortnite clips, in-game highlights, and overall post a ton of tournament gameplay. I mean, this is just drastically different from what Mr. Fresh Asian posts. It appears that Mr. Fresh Asian, you know, completely separates his channel from his professional career. And what we mean by this is, you know, despite having nearly 36,000 in earnings, he is still uploading very casual, entertaining videos like, you know, what you would see from strictly casual players like Laserbeam or Lachlan, two of his contemporaries. As a result of this, Mr. Fresh Asian is able to occupy both the casual and the competitive niches in Fortnite. This is something that is just unique and, you know, in our opinion, is the primary reason he's so successful in both realms to this day. I don't know about you, but I can't think of another Fortnite player in the community that occupies both the casual and competitive niches like Mr. Fresh Asian does. Honestly, like this is something that is just extremely difficult to do because you're not only having to spend like so many hours of time, you know, just creating and entertaining unique and viewer engaging content, but you simultaneously have to scram and practice your competitive career. Like, where does he have the time to do this? 
And so, you know, they're really challenging. And so in Fortnite, the competitive and casual community is entirely separate. Well, for the most part, at least. You know, a lot of times competitive players don't care to watch casual content and casual players don't really care to watch competitive content. And this is yet another reason why it's so incredibly impressive, man, like that he manages to simultaneously attract and entertain different audiences. All right, guys, so continuing with the content conversation, Mr. Fresh Asian is incredibly consistent with his content as well. Like, if you go to his channel, you're going to notice that all of his titles and thumbnails and length of videos are all relatively in unison. He's had no reason to just switch up his content because his style, well, it works. He posts similar videos, which has led to his fan base just like growing and growing and growing. And he has truly found really the content that people want to watch. Not only is he uploading almost daily, but it's just clear that his viewers absolutely love his content by him receiving millions of views on nearly every video. Overall, he doesn't get fancy and he just continues to push videos that people love to watch. And I just like it because he's just doing him man. he's just being him. And, you know, you guys got to be you. What's crazy about really the whole thing with Mr. Fresh Asian is that, you know, if you were to watch his videos, you would just mostly, you know, assume that he was just strictly a content creator. And now we know he's obviously pretty good at the game, but just watching his videos, he doesn't do anything particularly flashy or insane. But behind the scenes, Mr. Fresh Asian turns out to be like one of the most competitive Fortnite players in the entire OC region. When you only push out content to the casual community, some of us competitive minded people would assume you are just, you know, your stereotypical public match bot. Especially after you consider that despite being a professional player, all of his content is extremely casual. Another important factor that plays into his consistency topic is how consistent his video quality is. Okay, so when we look at his production quality, it's like next to none. His videos are entertaining and they always have a proper title and thumbnail. Although this might seem you know, obvious since the majority of the content creators hold themselves to this standard, you must consider that Mr. Fresh Asian, yo, he's doing this alongside playing professional professionally, man. This is not the typical quality that you see from most other professional Fortnite players, and it definitely makes him stand out. Overall, the consistency of this channel across the board and everything from his video style and upload schedule has led him to continue to grow an absolutely insane fan base along his professional career. Now, I know what you guys are probably thinking. Obviously, he's a talented gamer. Duh, right? He has nearly 36,000 earned from the game. In reality, I mean, is it so much deeper than that? <laughs> Anyways, man, the final thing that makes Mr. Fresh Asian so incredibly successful, both in his professional career and as a content creator, is the fact that he's just a talented gamer and influencer in general, right? Like, when you go to his channel, you can click on any video and just see how fun and entertaining Mr. Fresh Asian really is. Like, he keeps his videos a beat he's engaging which i love and you know on the other side of the spectrum anybody that can make nearly thirty six thousand in any competitive shooter is insane in itself it shouldn't go without being said that it takes a special person to be able to have the motivation you know to produce this type of content and still be able to place consistently at the highest level man this is respect for this guy i got so much for him I'm not gonna lie to you guys, like when I say that this is something that not very many people on this earth have the time or even motivation and skill set to achieve, I'm telling you, this is just incredible. So, you know, continuing, man, like most competitive players in Fortnite struggle to balance their life while solely competing. They might stream every, you know, so often and upload to YouTube, but nobody in the community manages to entertain an audience of nearly 7 million subscribers on YouTube alongside playing professionally. That's just borderline insanity. Mr. Fresh Asian is truly one of a kind. All right, let me know, man. Do you guys think there's anybody else in the community that has the skill set of Mr. Fresh Asian? Let me know what you guys think. I really want to hear your thoughts. All right, guys, now for a quick recap. First off, Mr. Fresh Agent's region really shouldn't be considered when discussing, you know, his earnings and placements. Despite playing in a statistically easier region, Mr. Fresh Agent still has managed to earn nearly $36,000 and consistently places extremely well in tournaments. Secondly, all right, the community that Mr. Fresh Asian has built around his casual Fortnite content has allowed him to occupy both the competitive and casual Fortnite community since he simultaneously 
you know, competes. All right, next, not only is the content that Mr. Fresh Asian uploads, like it's very entertaining, but he uploads consistently with a very structured video format, which I love. And finally, Mr. Fresh Asian is just simply talented. He really is. Like he's truly like one of a kind in the space with his work ethic and Fortnite skill, allowing him to manage an insane YouTube channel alongside his professional career. Like if you don't believe that you can be great, you know, check this guy out, man. Believe in yourself, think out of the box. You know, you can do it. For people that are telling you that you can't, you know, sometimes you kind of have to ignore it and you have to believe what's inside of you, all right? And I'm asking you, what's inside of you? Bring it out, you're right? You're special, keep going. Overall, you know, Mr. Fresh Asian is both an insane content creator and professional Fortnite player, right? Do you guys agree? Let me know in the comments below if you guys enjoyed this video. And listen, like the video, subscribe to the channel, share with all your friends about what's going on here on Pro Guys because we got so much more great content coming out you don't even know. As always, I am your motivation guy, and I'll see you soon.